Hi, and welcome back to AWC. It has been a great month for us in November. I just want you to know that uh, we had an amazing outcome in the last month. Let's quickly, you know, go through it as well. I just want to give you a thought of what all happened in the last month. But a quick brief, okay? Uh, the Nifty, I think, gained about 10 to 11% in that month in November. Uh, and uh, KWC had an overall uh, return of over 12 percent this does not include any of the uh, trades that we did on pan nifty and nifty or the short-term investments which also gained a lot just purely the fno side that i'm focusing on uh, based on the strategy that i use uh, and that itself gained 12 percent so the rest of it is not included in this in this uh, video which was also profitable uh, but personally when i started this journey with kwc we started small. We never imagined it would become as big as it is today. Uh, and this month's profit of almost 6.3 lakhs uh, on the FNO side is the largest seen so far by a huge margin. Uh, and that's simply amazing. And I really want to thank God for what He has done through this. And we've been able to touch lives and bless people, uh, teach people about investments and financial management. That itself is a big blessing. Uh, and it's not just us, okay? I just want you to know there are people who have outperformed not just the market, but also KWC as our partners. Uh, one person who's just 30-ish right now, and he has a capital of about eight and a half lakhs. He made a return of 1.85 lakhs this month, which is roughly 20%, and he outperformed us using us. And I'm really proud of him. Uh, another person who's I think 27-ish, late 20s, uh, with a with a capital of around five lakhs, he made a return of over one lakh plus, uh, and his return was around 23% for this one. So he also outperformed us. So I'm, uh, and there are other people who have done equally well, and I'm really proud of every person who's uh, working alongside KWC and doing well uh, their investments. Uh, and I'm really glad that God is using this to help others. Okay. Uh, so just let's take a quick dive into what has happened for us in November. All right. So let me just quickly share the screen with you. Uh, now, now you've been seeing this for a while now. Okay. I've been uh, getting you know, uh, returns all the time that I keep sharing with you. But here's what has happened for for us during this uh, this this month November. So on an investment of about 51 lakhs, we made about 6.3 lakhs, which is about 12.35% return. This has outperformed the Nifty, the market itself. But what is really amazing for me is this, this, this win percent, 100%. Now, other than a, a do or die uh, BPCL option that I bought, which didn't work out, everything else, especially based on our strategy, if, if we simply buy an option, that really doesn't count. If you simply buy a future, that really doesn't count for me. My, I had to hedge it. If it's hedged, and it should do well. So quickly, let me just show you 100% uh, accuracy this month, 6.3 lakhs. I, I was telling, I was telling myself, I'll be happy if we get, you know, two, three, two to three lakhs. Somewhere in between, I was saying two, three, two to three lakhs. I'm happy with it. I'm not. I don't want too much. Okay? But uh, and in in between. The landing, uh, the best ideal case for us looked like about five lakhs. Uh, and I was saying, okay, if I get four lakhs later on, if I, I said it, four lakhs is fine. But to actually end up with 6.3 lakhs was beyond my imagination as well. Uh, and simply, you know, uh, God just doing that for us. But let's just quickly look at what are the different shares that we took. We took budget pains, we shorted it, it didn't work out. Uh, and I actually made a loss on the future. But if you look here, I uh, made 10,000 rupees loss on the future, but the returns on the uh, hedges, that's why hedging is so good. I made 25,000. So overall made about 15,000 rupees on budget, right? Coal India, I didn't take any futures this time. It was uh, just a, you know, a, a strangle, straddle strategy that I used, uh, made 29,000 on Coal India. Coal India, again, no futures, just straddles, a bit of uh, strangles and a bit of a straddle. Uh, again, 32,000 there. Uh, Hero Motors, yes, I, I entered Hero Motors for one day. It was like a BTS trade that I did by today, sell tomorrow. Made a good return on that. 
but also I had a few, you know, I sold out of the money puts early on and I just held on to them. Uh, I kind of closed this call early. I should have made a lot more of that. But, uh, anyway, that was good. Good return, 60,000 there. Infratel is where the real big news was. In the last three, four days, it shot up. I bought it at 180. It went to 235. I sold it off to 220, which is fine. Okay. Uh, but the gain was about 1.13 lakhs. Uh, could have reached 1.3 lakhs. Again, the hedging really helped also. Uh, Reliance was a struggle for me. Reliance, the futures I made one to five hundred. And but again, and the hedging sometimes looked really horrible. But at the end of the day, somehow squeaked out a profit on Reliance also. Uh, SBI Life did well. SBI Life uh, made about eight thousand. UPL there was no futures involved, just uh, uh, spra Sprango, and that was a good return, twenty thousand on that. Um, then we had uh, HDFC on the last day. I forgot actually, uh, I was initially planning to buy a December future. I ended up buying November. Then I bought in December too. So I made money on the November also. So that was an added plus on the very last day. ITC, you can see, made about 20, 19,000 rupees. Lupin, I struggled. Uh, I didn't have a future on this, which is a good thing because Lupin was all over the place. But you can see by just angling it, uh, at different price ranges uh, eventually i got a profit but I, I really struggled with lupin itself because the price was all over the place i mean i need to be a little more careful there maridi i made a kind of a good return on the future and then the uh, all the uh, edges worked for me so that was a good good outcome for my 31000 there uh, mgl also worked out quite decently uh, 37,000 rupees there, including 26 on the future. So another 11,000 on the hedges. Sun Pharma is also really good. Sun Pharma uh, for 63,000 on the future, plus another 14,000 on the hedges. TCS was again a struggle future wise. It kept going up and down. Uh, eventually, it did, of course, I did sell the future, closed it out on a small profit. But the price, the real return was on the so that was a really good 50,000. Uh, TBS motor, really good again. Uh, good return there on the futures as well as. You see, the futures on TBS motors only gave me uh, 30, 36,000. 36, but the overall thing was 76,000, which meant that almost 40,000 came from the hedge. This is why I really like hedging, why it's so powerful, and why it's important to be patient hold on to the position towards the end unless you feel that this position is not going for you and you can still work out on making a profit even when the position is not that great by using hedges so you can see here all of these returned a profit and that was great so great month for kwc a great month for a lot of our partners i uh, really want to thank everybody who's been following i just want to encourage you to continue to you know subscribe and you know watch our videos, learn from it, use it, apply it, and you know, become successful in investments and trading on, on the stock market. Uh, follow rules, have stock trading rules, be disciplined in them, in following them, ensure that you know what is your strategy. Keep stock losses, don't get greedy, you will do well. This is an amazing return for this month. 12%, 6.3 lakhs for us, amazing return. So this is almost, Almost, okay, it's not exactly, but it's almost uh, the sum total of the previous three months. So what we earned three lakhs, roughly three lakhs in August, 25,000 in September, I'm oh, sorry, 85,000, two, two and a half percent in September, sorry, 85,000 something in September, uh, almost four lakhs in, uh, sorry, let me see this. So this, this month, I think, is like the sum total of what happened in the previous three uh, if you look at this in, in August, we earned roughly around 3 lakhs. In uh, September, even when the markets were crashing, market went down 8%, 9%. We still made 2.5%, 85,000 rupees there. Uh, October, we made about uh, 4 lakhs. Uh, and now 6.3 lakhs. So it's been a great journey so far. I hope you can also learn from this and you know, do something great. In case, okay, so these are two things that you need to think about. If you want to become a 
partner with us to learn how to do this. I think that's the best way to make a good return on the stock market. Uh, even if you get 5% return in a month. Okay, let me just do this numbers for you so you can see this, okay? Um, okay? Even, this is just numbers, okay? Imagine this. If you can make one five percent return in a month, okay. So that's one point zero five. Uh, in a year, if you and if you re keep reinvesting the money, you will end up with eighty percent return. Okay, eighty percent return in one year. What happens if you do this for seven years? You will see your investment or your capital increase sixty times just by doing the strategy. And if you're only earning 5% return per month, okay, I'm not saying that you'll always get 5%, but say an average of 5% and you keep investing that money back in, within seven years, you could see 60% 60 times your cap. Okay, per, just, just so you know, okay, this is the possibilities that can happen. A lot of people don't understand this, but it is really powerful. Uh, compounded, uh, the, the power of compounded growth is amazing so let me show you this again okay 